Uh, hello. <clears throat> hello, guys. You ready to get into it? Ready to hop right in? Full disclosure, um, Sam needed to use the webcam tonight for his sponsored stuff. So we've got no cam, but that's okay because I am in big snug mode. So I'm just going to chill and play this decidedly unchill game. And it'll be good. Can we get a last time? A, a recap on, on where we're at so far in this game? Uh, Yeah, we can do that. I think it might be easier, like, once we get inside... Yeah, on the last exciting episode of Dodger Ball Z, um, we had just beaten the Angler. <clears throat> and we're about to do Snow Zone. <sighs> so, um,. If you haven't watched this game before, if you don't know anything about this game, you haven't played it, you haven't watched anybody play it, please don't don't watch this right now. <laughs> um, we've done a decent amount in the game, I believe, so I really don't want to like spoil you on stuff, I guess. Um, but essentially, this game is a deck builder and an escape room in one. So. This part of the game is a, a roguelite deck builder. Um, and this is our little character. And we're playing against this guy, who's kind of like the weird dungeon master of the whole thing. But you can step away from the table and uh, look at stuff in here and try to solve puzzles and all sorts of other things. Take this guy's teeth, you know, just like whatever. Um, and uh, one day I'll get those. Yeah, so it's very interesting. It's very involved. It's like a it's a wonderful blend of things that I adore. I love puzzle games. I love deck builders. Um, so I've been having a blast with this game. Uh, but it's it's very bizarre. Um, if you are concerned about the fact that it's a horror game, it's mostly atmospheric horror. Um, a lot of the, like, creepiness of it is just, like, really good sound and art design. Um, it's made to be sort of unsettling and bizarre. Oh, no. Oh, no, I don't remember what our deck is like. Or attack power or bones. I don't think we had a lot of bones in this. Kin? I'm gonna go for attack power. Oof, we'll see. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Okay. Oh god, again, I don't know what I have. Um, unkillable. Right. Sure, I'll take the mantis. So as a reminder, no backseating, no spoiling. If you want to talk about what's going on in this game, if you've played the game already, if you have questions about things that you're not sure whether or not I've seen them before or whatever. Um, we have a channel in our Discord called The Spoiler Void. That's where you want to go, my friend. <clears throat> I'll just take a bunch of bottle buds. That sounds good, because I don't remember what this deck is like at all. Okay, good. I have Bone God. <gasps> and I have Everlasting Squirrels. 
I remember this now. Oh my god, I have everlasting squirrels. Ugh. Incredible. Okay, so who do I want first? What's going on here? Porcupine. Raven egg, raven egg. I want to get rid of those ASAP. Big Dinkle Mantis, our most powerful boy. <laughs> hmm. Not a great place to have to play that, but that's all right. <coughs> yeah, look at all these fresh squirrels, guys. Surely you can appreciate my fresh squirrels. Yeah, yeah. Um, maybe Toot Burger? Let's take Toot Burger. I don't, I can't imagine you can give me something better. Sure, I'll take another head for my collection, but Everlasting Squirrels is so top tier. Who could who could have named these people? Who did this? That's the exact same draw that I had last time. <laughs> and the same creatures? How how bizarre. It's weird that I'm coming to see you when we both know what's about to happen. <laughs> Probably gonna bite me in the butt. That's okay. All right, what do we got? Oh my god! Look at all of my boys. My deck is too big. Oh, it would be nice to have a strong, great white though. God. We did this last time and then we and then we did it again and we had a mantis god with five health and it was so strong. <sighs> oh my god, do we greed? Do we greed? Oh my god. <laughs> No, give it back. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> oh my god. I've really fucked myself with these pelts, haven't I? So many elk fawns. Oh my god, and I can't even... Uh... <sighs> okay. 
Okay. Again, should have put a squirrel down. Dingle. Mantis God. So powerful. Get in here, bitch. Not quite, huh? Okay, well, it's okay. This will be very satisfying. Yes. Good. <laughs> Hell yeah. Ugh. Six health, four attack, or two of the same kin. <laughs> oh god. Two? One. All right. Well, just kidding. I didn't want it anyway. <laughs> oh my god, wait. Yes. Let's get rid of a card. <sighs> Bullfrog is always easiest to get rid of. I could do an elk fawn as well. Um, two burgers, nice. I never managed to get the alpha in play. Let's put the bullfrog out there. I give that to Toot Burger. Oh my god, or Mantis God. Hmm. He doesn't have anything. Let's give it to him. He's got two mustaches now. What happened? Boy! Okay, I've never beaten this boss, so... Let's fucking go. I got some smoke, because I crushed it. <clears throat> it's the traps that are hard in this one. Like, what do you do about these fucking traps, you know?
for the first time ever. Opposing it perishes, a pelt is created in your hand. Right, so there's, I guess, just nothing you can do. there to be honest. God, I've never gotten this far. Oh my God, I will accept only the finest pelts for them. will stay and fight for me. I want that. <clears throat> that. 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 I would have chosen differently. Is that it? That's all I can take? Okay. a lot of the really good stuff though. I do feel that way. Does he have three? Oh, you're right. You're right, bitch. Fine.
chops, but... Just leave it as that right now. Get fucked. That's it. Boom, bitch. Oh my god. I haven't beaten you before. Perhaps one of these will entice you. Amoeba. What's this? Trapper and trader now bleeding into the snow, you persist. You could see a light in the distance. The end is near. Oh my god. We will need another map. Um. Okay. I will go here. I want this. And I want this. And I want, I don't need a squirrel. This. Oh my god, okay. Your eyes have fixed themselves on the small cabin, its warm light, a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely this cabin marked the end of your travails. It's just gonna be the cabin I'm already in, isn't it? I hate this. Am I supposed to, oh. Steps away from the strange cabin, you are presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my books to just any traveler. If you are able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. The trial of the winged. The three drawn cards must include a card with the airborne sigil. Three drawn cards must include a pelt. Three drawn cards must include a card with the sprinter sigil. Mm. I feel like I still have a lot of pelts in there. Trial of skins. Yes! Success. I will grant you one of my most powerful boons. Cards that dramatically alter the game. You don't even need to draw them. Just passives, huh? The boon of the forest. You'll start a battle with grand furs on all of your spaces. Ambidextrous. You may draw twice at the beginning of your turn. The boon of the magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any card in your deck to draw. What? That seems insanely powerful. We will repeat that once more. Must include a rare card. Must include Waterborne. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. The trial of the ring? I don't have a ring, do I? Why does this say 11 o'clock? Oh my god. Oh my god. I. Don't let me forget this. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that to you. No, never mind. I'm going to write it down for myself. <laughs> I don't trust y'all. Not to say too much. 11 o'clock. Oops, shit. <clears throat> okay, sorry. I don't think I'm going to get this one. I don't think I have any of these. Oh, I did. Oh my god, my very first one. 
Amoeba is a rare success. Alright. Oh, it will start a battle with eight bones! Or the magpie's eye. Both of my boons. I rarely say this, but I am impressed. You've been a worthy adversary, but unfortunately I must soon put you to death. Hey, how come the light went out, homie? Oh! <gasps> you took your time out there. And I'm itching for another game. Mm -hmm. Are you ready to play? The mushrooms. You have mushrooms on your face. Oh. I hope you are adequately prepared. Perhaps one more to be safe? What? Oh, come on, dude. Oh my gosh. Does he have all of their abilities now? He has Mantis God. Grateful shithead. space to put bullshit, just like I like it. Hmm, what is a meat? 
about? What do you do? Shadowy figures appear before you. In their eyes glimmers a recognition of kinship colored by guilt. They were betraying you. The fries are gone. <laughs> the fries are gone. What a fantastic card to draw. I also remember that one fondly. I'm glad it's not just me. Um, okay, great. Well, you're gonna take the squirrel, so. Why are we drawing again before you take the squirrel? What is that all about? I might as well take him. He's gonna kill fries are gone. And then poopy whoopy's gonna come out. Um, this thump's about to go away. This is seven damage that's gonna go straight through. Yes. 
damn moon. It's dramatic, yes, but it provides no value to my board. Now that is value. We have to destroy the moon? Card bearing the sigil will strike each opposing space that is occupied by a creature. It will strike directly if no creatures oppose it. At the beginning of its owner's turn, card bearing the sigil will pull small creatures like squirrels into its orbit. really destroyed the moon. I suppose all that's left is to finish me off. Go on. Oh my, did I just, I think I just beat him. Oh shit. <clears throat> Haven't I been saying this whole time that I think this is a game within a game? gamers I'm the lucky Carter and this is another pack opening video today I am opening catch monsters packs and digging for that epic shiny transcend dog and here I'll add some crazy VFX with lightning bolts or something okay ladies and gentlemen I am about to open my first pack feeling good about this one feeling real good Ooh, what do we got here Okay, and our first rare is a Urchkin. Not exactly a viable competitive card, but hey, it's a pretty one. All right, next pack. Feeling even better about this one. I gotta say, these cards are feeling extra silky today. I mean, they're so smooth. Not sure what they're doing down there at the uh, the card factory, but um, things are feeling good in my hands. Okay, let's see what we got here. Yep. Some jank cards. 
maybe a few additions to my draft cube. We'll see. And our rare for this pack is Bamdog. Not exactly riveting so far, but we have many packs to go. Next pack, here we come. Oops, cut out this part. Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is a vintage pack opening video. Today I'm opening a few super rare old packs I snagged at a garage sale. I've got four packs of Inscription. You would not believe the deal I got on these. Now, not all of you will even remember this game. I'm barely old enough to have uh, seen these going around in my childhood. Uh, for whatever reason, they only did one set of these cards and then stopped printing them. Uh, there's not a huge market for them anymore, but at the rate I got them for, there's not really much to lose. That being said, a foil mantis god goes for a couple hundred bucks. So, um, understandably, <laughs> it's the best card in the game. Really cool art on these. Definitely stands the test of time. And our rare for this pack is Blue Mage. Cool looking card but not going to be worth very much. All right. Blue mage? What we got going on in the second pack? Where's my blue mage? Huh. Uh, this pack has been opened and resealed. Hope no one snuck the rare out of it. They suck. Come on, people, honestly. Who opens and reseals? I want there to be a card with his face on yeah. it. There's a set of coordinates on this card. Ah, uh, never mind. <laughs> I guess that would be too hard too fast. Like were drawn on with a pen. 49 degrees north, 123 degrees west. You'll see a weird cabin, but don't worry about it. Uh, I think... It's I'd fine. Check, but I think that's pretty nearby. All right, you guys, I'm out here living my best life. Got my trusty headlamp and shovel. Always come prepared, kids. All right. Your trusty Ooh. headlamp? What do you do for fun slash a job? Yeah. Okay. Whew. Oh, what did that card say? Oh, Getting I'm... close. I think, assuming there is a thing to get close to, this very well may be a massive waste of. Can't wait. No. Ah. Oh. Oh, son of a bitch! I just wanted to pause it. I'm prepared, kids. You guys are gonna be so sick of this by the time. <laughs> okay, I'm on pause. There we go. Yeah. Oh, I can't tell what it says. Okay. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. I think Woo. it's fine. Oof, no thanks. All right. That's why you always bring an extra battery, boys and girls. Every time. You got to come prepared. <sighs> okay. Yeah, if someone gave me coordinates, I would not know if they were near my house or not. I'd be like, those sure are latitude and longitude. <laughs> All right, this is it. Oof. 
And now, we dig. What? Okay. Yeah. Guess there was a method to the madness. I give a 75% chance it's a rock. But, only one way to find out. is that oh my god you guys i can't believe it there's actually something here Guys, are you seeing this? I'm, uh, I'm a little confused. On a floppy drive of all things. Like, didn't you need to make sure that floppy disks stayed really clean? <laughs> Is it gonna play? Can you even go home and play that right away? Okay, time to figure out what's on this thing. gonna try to start a new game and it's gonna error error oh no he doesn't even try what the fuck who is this guy who's this madman yeah i do not celebrate often and i seldom give gifts but you challenger you are worthy do not be polite, dig in. Uh, is there something wrong? Your prize awaits. Very well, come with me. Stand right there. Oh my god. can't pick it up. Oh, the new game. I can do a new game now. I'm scared. I'm ready for the jump scare. I'm ready. Everybody gets one. It's fine. You've earned it, game.
Do I have to like alter deck? I'm wondering if I have to leave the game. And start a new game, like if that's what it's trying to tell me, you know, which would make sense given what just happened. Yeah, here we go. Yep. Beginning the world did not know cards. Hey, it's the globe that's on his shelf with the with the hand doing the gotcha. Until the day the scribes arrived. Oh, oh my god. The other sentient cards are the other scribes. Each had their own method of inscription to create cards. <clears throat> Grimora used her quill to inscribe the epitaphs of the dead. Leshy used his wildlife camera to capture beasts. So Leshy's the only one left. P03 used a particle scanner to copy the CPUs of robots. He actually was a robot. I'm gonna die. Magnificus used his brush to paint his wizard pupils. With the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power. Until one day a challenger arrived to replace one of the scribes. <clears throat> starting deck to mark your ambition. Your ambition is to replace Grimora and become the scribe of the dead. What is this one? Scribe of beasts. Scribe of technology. Scribe of magic. Let's do it, Grimora. The cards were added to your collection. <clears throat> oh my god. What the fuck? Woof, I was just about to call it quits out here. But now that there's a challenger in our midst, it's back to work for me. I should be able to get this bridge fixed in. Full disclosure, it'll take me exactly as long as it takes you to defeat one of those scribes. So, uh, come back later. Oh, but I like Grimora. You're here! Marvelous! I'm Grimora, scribe of the dead. Until quite recently, I was disgraced, though I was returned to my former glory with the help of some unlikely friends. If you wish to test your skills against me, you must first prove your wits. You must discern which tomb marks the final resting place of my lovely ghouls. Which tomb marks the final resting place of my ghouls? Oh no, oh no, do not perceive me. Do not snarl or sniff, I beg you. If you wish to battle, please let us get it over with. Oh, something's wrong. It's your deck, or rather your lack of a valid one. You've got 20 cards in it, right? Uh. Invalid. That looks much better. Now, where were we? Oh my god, this is so bizarre. Ma 
Marvelous, your first battle. Are you surprised to see me here? You did select my starter deck. In order to play my cards, you will need to collect bones. You gain a bone when... Why do your eyes glaze over? Marvelous, you already understand. My time as an insect was not a total waste. Grave Digger will generate a bone. You do not have enough bones to play that. Oh, right. Okay. Interesting, seeing it all like this. I have how many bones? What does it say? Oh, one. Oh man, come on. Dear, does this mean you'll try again? Hark, a living slice of lemon approaches, bright and trig as a lime. You think you'll squeeze it to feed out of me? I don't know, dude. Probably not. But I do understand how this game works now, which is like a huge plus. Ghost ship moves to new space and a skeleton jumps the ship. Oh, goodness gracious. Side is released, right? So much bone. There we go. I win. You beat the pulp out of me. Firstly, take you this. You received a deathly card back. Nice. An opal dies, four bones are awarded instead of one. When another creature you own dies, it is returned to life and dies again immediately. 
opposing creature is placed opposite to an empty space. Bonehound will move to that right. Bonehound. Because you bested me with yell, share, share my secret. My name's Royal. It's the far right tomb. Here's the headpiece. You found a piece of an epitaph. It reads Royal Dominguez, 1589, spring 1632. You found a piece of an epitaph. Hit by a falling piece of ice. You found a card pack. Ooh. I'm gonna take a quick break and see if we have any pain meds. Be right back. Sorry, my my period decided to say hello right before the stream, and I was like, hopefully the nausea doesn't hit while I'm streaming. But that would be too easy, wouldn't it? One minute.
Okay. I got some meds. We'll see how they do. If they don't do nothing, then we might have to end the stream, which really sucks because this shit's getting wacky. And I want to keep playing, so. Welcome back. I hope they help. Thank you. Me too. <laughs> yeah. I spent most of the workday with hormonal headaches. Oh, I'm sorry. It's so crazy how it's, I mean, it makes sense. All bodies are different, etc. But it's really interesting to me how, like, hormones affect people completely differently, you know? Ah, okay. Okay, what the fuck are we doing? So this is like actual deck builder stuff now, which I'm not good at. <laughs> so we'll do our best. Let's see. Um, Frank and Stein. I don't even remember seeing him. Grows into a more powerful form after one turn on the board. Okay. Oh, I only have one. Okay. What's happening? When dead hand is played, discard your hand and draw a new hand. Oh, interesting. Um, I guess. I guess. What is this? Eaten by a hungry dog. Does not hold a grudge. Bird, did someone leave the AC on? Come on, dude, it's freezing in here. Maybe a heated battle will help.
there's no cure. These are all of the pieces that we see in the... Why am I a robot? Life didn't give me lemons. Okay. Card back. Okay. You chewed me out. Now please look away. Turn your eyes to this card pack instead. I'm called Sawyer. The middle stone marks my grave. Please do not go digging up my bones. Sawyer Patel, 1702 to fall of 1778. Robot now. Brought down by scurvy. Oh. Hey. <clears throat> you have no offering? Uh I don't I don't know why I could, maybe. I see. Do not sniff or snarl. Wait, I should probably ask him again. Brought down by scurvy. Pro the probably there was no cure, I would assume. Okay, I need to adjust my deck pretty badly.
So weird. Why am I a robot? Oh, I guess you can just change what you look like. It's just it's just to change what you look like. It had no meaning. Okay. Okay. are not my friend this day. Let's see. Thick droid. Let's try let's try this. Let's try just a, a little bit of everything. Hell yeah. Chunk boy. Let's go. A thick lad. Oh, right. I need two. There 
we go. A balanced deck is a good deck. You won, but now I'm a bit less cold. Take a pack on the house. Thank you. The Warren. I know, I know these cards. It's a Unix system. You did beat me. I guess I gotta fess up. The name's Casey, Casey Hobbs, from the tombstone on the left. The defibrillator failed. sure does not hold a grudge probably brought down by scurvy there was no cure yeah noise marvelous I believe you have proven your wits adequately are you prepared you will not defeat me uh. <laughs> Give me a sec. Give a girl a second. This is still inscription. This game got super weird. And if you weren't here for it, maybe, <laughs> maybe come back another time. <laughs> I feel like you're getting hella spoiled right now. Oh my god, it costs six. But then it never dies. <laughs> Worth. Just marvelous. I was beginning to worry I would be sealed away behind those tombstones forever. Locked down at the mercy of a challenger's wits until one day discovered. I see that your ambition is to become the scribe of the dead. I think you are aware I currently hold that title. But it matters not, because you shall not win. On guard! <clears throat> My minions never truly die, you know. Let's see how you fare. Oof. Okay. They're dancing! Cute. Four bones out of this, though. Oof. Okay, I can kill this. Ooh. Uh oh. An opportunity to use my quill! Rip Mummy Lord. Turn two to turn four. This one will be back. Shit. You wish to become the scribe of the dead and that's your best deck? I have nothing to worry about. Hmm.
No, no fish, no pass. Okay. Is that the prospector? Pried the chest open and found a card pack. Nice, look at all these sweet boys. Dag nabbit, that dang hound got herself lost again. You think you're getting past? Think again. Not till I get some proof my girl's all right. blood and stuff here. Take a stinking pile of meat from the safe. Okay, that's cool. That's normal. Surely this is four, but it's not. Because this has jumped in front. There we go. Disappointing, but I also accept foils. Accept foils. I'm not sure what that means. Stop shaking. The only thing you have to fear is your own inadequacy. Behold me. I am Leshy, the scribe of beasts. We share a desire for you to challenge me, but first... I know what you're thinking. This is not my legendary camera, not the one I used to create beast cards. This one is a mere replica. You may use it to create photos of the beasts in these woods. My subordinates, the prospector, the angler, and the trapper. They each require a photo before they will consider battling you. Return to me when they are all defeated. Okay. Now 
fish, no pass. Do I need a picture of fish? He wants a picture of his dog, but like... Crazy? Um. Oh my god, I have a mantis god. Let's see. Goodness. Nice. You're halfway there, though you may not like what comes next. Oh, Lord. Oh, fuck. Rip all your cards? Do you miss them? Fear not, I'll give them back. As corpses. I like that we're, like, consistently acknowledging that there's a different person that's playing this game now. God, what can I do with them? Anything? Sure, use some stuff that needs bones right now. <laughs> no, nope. damn.
like <coughs> I think we do need stuff that that uses bones cuz I think stuff will con will still drop bones, you know. Here's the rub now. So I've now painted myself into a corner in the opposite direction. Sure. <laughs> sure, I'll try the auto-completed one. See how that goes. Oh, well, this is going good so far. Never mind. Okay. So the skeletons are actually like basically our squirrels currently. So we should have a bunch in there. some cards that utilize the bones. And then we need cards that use the energy.
I know, the Mantis God is worth like 200 bucks, dude. Welp. In the business, we call that a strong start. Oops. Oh, shit. <coughs> nice. Both? Come on, man. Shit. Oh my god. Okay, now I have to kill this sarcophagus. Easy. Yeah, this part of the game is way tougher because they're actually making you deck build. <laughs> Thank you. 
If I play this, the Bonehound is just going to follow me. Yeah, they just have no attack power anymore. Actually, okay. No, he's blocking him. He's gonna explode at the end of the turn anyway, I just realized. Two cards left? Oh my god. Starvation? What the fuck? God, this is so much harder than the game was before. Shit. Hmm. I prefer the old cabin creepy vibes. Same. Smell that meat on you, and I'm still missing that dang hound. Can't you put a little in her bowl? I guess. Oh. Well, I'll be darned. That's my girl. I'll let you pass me and into yonder pond. But first, we got a battle. Okay, bud. Let's go.
nice. Hell yeah. Fair's fair, you beat me like a dog. Take this, Some th say these here cards are better than gold. I thank you. The way to yonder pond is clear. Pond, huh? Now I have a picture of fish. Place the photo of bait on the line. Yeah, sure. Still must feed. All right, let's go. Okay, they're gonna move around, so I should put him there. forgot that that would matter. <laughs> well, that's obnoxious. Fucking war of attrition. <laughs> I 
have three cards left. <laughs> Uh, just kill me. Do have a new robot. And I have wizard stuff. All the robots. I think I only need one sarcophagus. Well, look, fight fish with fish. That's what I always say. <laughs> oh, interesting. That was easy. <laughs> of dried blood crackled as you pried the chest open, but there are two packs inside. Nice, very cool. Killing again. What? What the fuck?
but I don't even know where the... I don't even know where he is, though. The foot of a pelt, the traitor next door may desire it. Okay. Oh, right, because they're the same person. You brought a pelt, I'm pleased. Yet another turn at the skinning knife. It's time to set another trap. Yep. I smell the hare's blood on you. Right. been a good run, guys. make a fine pelt come on you don't gotta say shit like that I we get it you're creepy I get it I really really do <laughs> unnecessary this behavior did it. <laughs> the trap is shut, yet the prey escapes, and the trapper waits for the next victim. You've defeated the three of us now. Leshy awaits. Squirrels. them flies. Wait, why is it letting me put in more? It let me save that. It let me save that. I don't think it was supposed to. For me, no, it was. 21 out of 20? Does, does it not care? Oh my God. Found yourself standing before your ultimate match. Leshy, steal yourself from my beasts will show you no mercy. 
Do not spare your creatures. My camera is waiting to capture them at the moment of their demise. My beasts are famished. Oh my goodness. <coughs> sigils. Oh no, that's a terrible sigil to grab as well. There we go. One. I won't be needing those. I have something better. What the fuck? You must like them, though the stitch work is my own. They are your cards. Oh my god. My beasts enjoy a varied diet. What the fuck, dude? is only as satisfying as the struggle that precedes it. Lashy! What the fuck is going on with you, dude? You are a mess. <laughs> Lashy, that boy ain't right. Oh my god. Okay, well, it's fine. I'll just be at a standstill for a second here. Shush. 
First round done. I only had Manta Slord out there. So that's good at least. Dang it. Hmm. Well, if I destroy my own warren. That'll do. Ah. Oh dear. <clears throat> you really defeated me. I was not expecting that. You won't replace me, will you? Your ambition is to take my title, but there's something you may not know. There will come an opportunity to change your mind, and I beg that you spare me. Take these and then go. If you are reading this, it must be because you wish to challenge me, Magnificus, to a card battle. In order to earn that privilege, you must first defeat my three graduate students. As for their whereabouts, that is for you to discover. Sincerely, Magnificus. <coughs> is one of his students the slime? Because that would really just make my day. A strange monocle, you put it on. <gasps> the master's eye. The inside of the chest is covered in a sticky green goo. Yes! Oh, I guess if you do this right, it opens probably. Cards. Oh. <coughs> oh, interesting. So 
was just showing me if I have all of the cards or not. That's pretty cool. is unbearable. My organs are melting. Do you see? Magnificus turned me into goo for my final exam. I just need to defeat one more challenger and then, then I will earn my rightful place. My rightful place in the deck of the master as one of his prized cards. Nothing will stop me. I knew it. Oh, sweetheart. Oh my god, the music is so unsettling. <laughs> Oh my god, I misunderstood which card I used. Pfft. Well. Well, that's just fine, isn't it? It was all worth it. Please report my victory to the master quickly if possible. Challenge me. Let's see your deck. Weak cards. Total lack of synergy. This pile really doesn't stand a chance against me. Look, I'm trying to finish up my conduit control list here, but the bots they're sending down the line are trash. Get those workers to send me something good. Tell them to throw themselves on the line if necessary. And please have a decent deck by the time you're done. It all makes sense. Fucking stoat. It all makes sense now. <laughs> Dude. I like that I still got the monocle on, that's fun. What do you want? 
<laughs> you see, I'm very, 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 I'm very busy here. P P03 isn't happy with my output, but I'm merely the inspector. To put better bots on the line, I would need to... Who are you to be carrying orders from P03? P03 would only trust someone with some semblance of card game skill. I'm very busy, but I must know if you are qualified to give me orders. Oh, goodness. Uh... <laughs> Of course I am qualified, that is. Oh, interesting. <coughs> Circuit destroyed, bitch. Get off the stage. Dear, your message from P03 must indeed be genuine. As I mentioned, I'm a mere inspector, not an engineer, not a designer. I can't send new bots down the line, but I can send myself. I'm proud to have served P03 faithfully. Well met, stranger. What? What? Oh my god. Um, okay, well. Oh, plus one to everything? Stops the charge.
put these anywhere? Oh, shit. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, okay. <gasps> you have to use everything else? I have to use everything? Ugh. But why? Why do I gotta use it all? Okay, hold on. they come over here they lose their color oh i guess because they're they've just been burned that's why okay interesting. okay wait ah oh, blissful silence for a second okay interesting so the charges can be used for Okay, so. And it seems like maybe this is almost like magic, like land. <laughs> like you have land cards almost. Oh Lord, okay. And now I know that these like actually do something. So that's cool. Hmm. <coughs> I like literally don't know what any of that shit is. And at this point, I'm too, I'm too nervous to add them to a deck. My deck is already getting too thick. <gasps> no! Oh my god! Has this turned into a frustrating mechanics game? Um, it went from more of like a as-you-play deck builder into an actual deck builder, which I am not good at at all. So... It's not that I feel like my progress has halted, but that like I'm suddenly much more out of my element. Um, so not not as ideal for me, <laughs> I guess.
Sure. I almost did it again. Oh my god. Yeah, I, mi I miss the cabin big time. <laughs> I think the game does a good job of teaching as it goes along. Uh, I would disagree when it comes to this part, but that's okay. good at teaching the puzzles or the deck building the deck building it's i mean again the entire game up to this point is not is a is a deck builder based on like you are playing the game and you pick from what it offers you and you build the deck as you go not you press tab and build a deck <laughs> right those are two different types of deck builders um so man all of these have been easy until this one <laughs> Don't let me get me, dude. Not me out. Ha ha ha. What was that? We are. I am the melter. They send me raw materials and I, well, you can see how it works. Let me out. Not another word out of you. We must have a card battle. Oh, goodness. <clears throat> ah, the classic boy trapped in a boy. Come on. 
It doesn't have to be this way. Hey, but I got foils. Hey, there we go. But that aside, what did you come to tell me? P03 wishes for better bots for his scanner. That's difficult, you see. I melt the metal, but I can't reprogram the stamping machine. There's a way to send at least one new bot down the line. Yes, for P03. Oh my god. Uh, okay, well. Guess that guy's dead. Oh my god. I sound off um, probably because it's nighttime and that's when my like weird dry cough is the worst <laughs> what you're here for. You're asking me to take a dive. <laughs> I can't accommodate you. You got special orders looking to dredge something special. We can duel. Maybe even give you something if you win. But I can't be taking a dive. P03 will understand. You're welcome for not doing that accent. Can't take me eyes off me work here. I'll give you this and what? What? Take your pack? What? What the fuck? <laughs> off with you. I need to concentrate. P03 is gonna reward me big for this and what is that? What's happening there? What is all that? artifacts going up there. Wait, what? Oh my god. Bots haven't gotten much better, but you battled all my workers and you actually won? Give me that deck again. Wow, you beat them with that? All right. <laughs> Maybe there are some synergies I missed. Let's go. <laughs> there aren't. Oh my god, don't do this. Need these conveyor belts just like my factory. At the very least, they ought to test your lane positioning. Oh my god. 
No. So, why you gotta do this shit to me? can attack past this. Okay, interesting. Are these mine now? <laughs> they attack for zero, so <coughs> just deal with it. Oh, that means us. <laughs> Oh my god, that means everything? Jesus. Okay. Well. C'est la vie, I suppose. You open the crates around the temple, right? You need better cards. I know. Hold on. God. Just hate building decks. <laughs> I just hate it, Stoat. I hate it. It's not fun. Establishing circuits is difficult. I don't know. This deck's too big. Let's try. The old dredger wouldn't hop on the line? Don't worry. That's acceptable. Another bell. Wait, he knew that the other robots would just get on the line? That's pretty fucked up. That's better.
Yeah, I'm the same. Like, letting... Letting sort of RNG determine how I'm doing in the game is far less stressful for me. Oh, scanner's online. Which card to scan? Just kidding. Obviously the one with the best stats. Stat line could be better. Oh my god. What the fuck have you done? Absolute child. <laughs> Good. Nice luck you had. I guess playing a perfect game is no match for good RNG. I guess you won. Your ambition is to become the scribe of the dead. That naive spinster. You ought to reconsider. videos to watch, huh? I think I've just got to send it. To whom it may concern. It's a bit formal. Hello there! Exclamation point. My name is Luke Carter and I'm a fan of your collectible card games. If you've ever taken a look at my YouTube videos, you will know how appreciative I am of the merch that you've sent me over the years. So it was a great surprise to learn that there is a digital version of Inscription. I think maybe one of my fans pranked me and buried a copy in the woods near my house. Upon further research, however, I have not been able to find any record of this game. Is this some kind of elaborate hoax? Any trace of this game? Is this some kind of elaborate hoax? The game doesn't seem like the work of a prankster. It at least appears professionally made. I am both puzzled and excited by this discovery. Any information you can provide would be much appreciated. Thank you, The Lucky Carter. Okay, good enough. Nice email, homie. Yeah. I like that he's documenting all of this. <laughs> That's a good frame. <clears throat> hey, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this... I want to know well, it's what he changes video. his green um, screen into. It's actually more of a question to my audience. As I've learned over the years, nobody knows card games better than you guys do. So I'm hoping someone can help me out here. Did anyone ever play an inscription video game or hear about it? I'm talking about that vintage one set card game I opened packs for last week. I don't know what I'm allowed to say. I don't want to get in any trouble here. Um, I think I've got the only known copy of the digital version of Inscription. I've been uh, filming myself playing it, and uh, it's weird, guys. <laughs> uh, I don't want to get in any hot water by showing the footage, but can someone please prove me wrong? Please tell me someone has a copy of this game. I have been looking online for days, and I cannot find a word about it. I reached out to the publishers, hoping maybe they would get back to me. But as a fallback, I got you beautiful viewers. Hopefully dig up something. Um, that's it. <laughs> that's the video today, guys. 
Uh, thank you so much, as always. And, um, oh yeah, uh, what the fuck is the car? What? Homie, you need a new camera. Your shit's getting fucked up all the time. Mr. Carter, we have received your inquiry regarding a digital version of our intellectual property inscription. We can assure you that no such software exists in any official form. However, if you have indeed committed possession of proprietary game Kino hardware... Wait. Okay, wait. <laughs> I'll come every two... Wait a minute. <coughs> Is this... Is this dude... How come every time we play the video game, it says battery low or low battery? What battery? Are you setting up a camera and pointing it at your computer and filming it that way? What? What is your process? Why are you running out of... In... What is your setup? He's a YouTuber. He know... He... Oh my god. You are compelled to return to us under the Computer Fraud and Abuse Act. The hardware will be considered stolen... You don't need a capture card. It's on a floppy disk. OBS is free. In front of the box. You may mail the package at a local post office. We would like to avoid taking legal action in your case, so please do not delay returning the proprietary software. Sincerely, Game Funa, Customer Happiness Department. What the fuck? <sighs> what did that say? We don't know what this game is. We've never we've never made a game. What the fuck. No, again. <sighs> okay. Play it again. Do it ag again. Oh, God damn it. Mr. Carter, we have received your inquiry regarding a digital version of our intellectual property inscription. We can assure you that no such software exists in any official form. However, if you have indeed committed possession of proprietary... Sorry, I was so distracted by how offended I was <laughs> about the <laughs> battery low. It's the same, it's the same UI. He's pointing this camera at his computer. I'm sorry, I'm not paying attention. You may mail the package at a local post office. We would like to avoid taking legal action in your case, so please do not delay returning the proprietary software. Sincerely, Game Funa, Customer Happiness Department. What the fuck? I think this woman's actually from Game Funa. She came to my door yesterday what? and I didn't answer. What? This time I'm gonna record it. What? What? Hi! Hi there! Hey. I'm floppy disk for a game called Inscription. What? Why is he wearing different clothes? Buy a copy of it somehow? Uh, Are his clothes exactly? different? No. What? No? No, I don't know anything about that. Inscription, you said? Yes. No, I don't think so. Really? Because, um, apparently you emailed us about it. You are, uh, Luke Carter, right? Oh. You know the Lucky Carter gmail.com? Yeah, uh, you know what? That's, uh, I am Luke Carter, but that's not my email address. Right, because, uh, I just noticed because I've seen your videos. Oh. <laughs> on a movie thing. Oh. <laughs> Just got her Thanks foot in walking. the doorway, dude. That's oh my god, that Listen, makes me so uh, anxious. How did you know where I live exactly? My boss gave me your address. And how did you get past the side gate? It's locked. <laughs> okay, Luke. Um, I'm going to give you my business card, and if you remember anything, anything at all, feel free to give me a call. Okay. Will do. Take care. Bye, Luke. <laughs> <clears throat> Luke, what happened to your clothes? What the fuck? Luke, what happened to your clothes? Luke, what is happening to you? Am I crazy? Look. I think this no? woman's actually from Game Funa. 
She came to my door yesterday and I didn't answer. This time I'm gonna record it. Look, look, look. Hi. Hi there. Hey. I'm floppy disk for a game called Inscription. Was... Anyways. Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Today I'm opening Secrets of Legendaria. Hoping for that sweet, sweet foil Thalamere. Oh no, he's recording at night. Oh, bro, we've all been there. <laughs> okay. Upset with me. Is Dex losing her mind? I don't think so. Oh my god. You found us. This is good. This is good. We require duplicates. Do you see the diagram? Two of that. You have the cards. Yeah, I do. This is good. Close your eyes. This will be gruesome. Here's your prize. Thank you. Do you have another one you need? Two of that. I don't think I'd have two of that. Not this time. I'll do my best. Try again. Let me try one more time.
Yeah, I actually really like this song. played a card with an activated ability. Allow me to explain how it works. Activate it by pressing the sigil like it's a button. It will only work if you can pay the cost. Pay one energy to deal one damage to the creature across from Plasma Jimmy. Oh my god. Yes, please. Sounds good to me. Excessive. Does this one also have an activated ability? Oh, I see. Yes. <laughs> sure. scribe was incredibly bested. Far away a light enveloped a long forgotten monument. You had triumph, narrowly avoiding tooth and claw. The scribe of beasts was defeated. You were able to defeat me beggar's belief, but now I must yield to you. My only regret is that our battle was so brief. Surely the summit of our victory is made sweeter by a more arduous ascent. Legs. Stop. What is that? Uh. Oh. I had to see your face after you lost. You're just so bad. It's no wonder we're back here again. And we would have been even sooner if the disc wasn't lost. Take a long look at this face, because you'll never see it again. The stone face! I'm done being your pet, you stinking beast. Damn. Incredible. I pushed it too far that last time. Why don't they see? To live as a beast would be the noblest thing. Even so lowly a creature is a stoat. Can I... am I... am I good to leave? I 
love, I love that Stoat showed up. I know his name isn't actually Stoat, but I love that he showed up just to be like, hey man, fuck you. <laughs> Oh, he digs twice. I see. Interesting. Yeah, um, yeah, if you watched earlier and you're showing up now and you're thinking to yourself, what the fuck happened to this game? Um, a, lo a lot, a lot happened in this game. <laughs> Almost 30 card deck, idiocy. Hey, bosom bud. I passed my final exam. We're done. Please, not again. <coughs> I have to fight you again, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> No, please. Please, just tell the master I passed. He won't know the difference. Here, take this pack. I can open the door for you. 
Oh, nice. Thanks, bud. Oops. Suddenly it springs to motion. Oh, God. Okay. Wing, skull push wing, skull push wing, skull push wing. Oh my god. Just imagine you're an ice cube slowly melting on a hot pan. Oh, I was talking to myself. The pain of being a head impaled on a spear is... Well, it is worth it, of course. Magnificus will award me the highest honor. I will be the centerpiece of his deck. Oh god. They're like... They feel like... Greek god archetypes somehow. Oh my god. This new spore digger is like really, really worth it. <laughs> nice. Hmm, perhaps I will not be central to his strategy. I care not, he can use me as a chump blocker. I have mastered disappointment. Take this pack. Master disappointment. Oh, goodness. But what's here? Oh, it just takes you back down. Oh, that's not exciting. I'm still trying to figure out what the fuck is going on with this. The top sigil is found by the greedy. The bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing or by those who hear too easily. The 
middle sigil is found by the pale. The greedy. Middle sigil is found by the pale. headphones on completely first. <laughs> Has to be in here. Top sigil is found by the greedy. Bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing or those who hear too easily. Middle sigil is found by the pale. Like when you go in here, you can't hear as well, so this has to be...
shovel is found by a pail. <laughs> That's obviously not it. Must operate differently because I'm positive that these two are correct. But it's not like before where if you get it right, it's just like, yeah, you did it. I mean, I think it's a shovel. Oh, are we fighting again? This is where you farm foils. I see. Um. Time I tried this spot. Find good fish, corrupted fish, old fish. Woof, you probably saw that the bridge is fixed. Now they want me to give you deck building tips. Like, use your rare cards, they're more powerful than common cards. But sure, I'm sick of being around these scribes. Each has a more twisted ambition than the last, I tell ya. Leshy? That guy's insane. He wants to use challengers like you as his playthings. To make it more perverse, he thinks you'll actually enjoy it. Oh yeah, try to use a mix of different types of cards in your deck to fully utilize your bones, blood, and energy. <laughs> Woof. <laughs> P03, that bot is planning something all right. It's got the dredger working overtime. Oh, many cards from other temples are better sacrifice fodder than squirrels. <laughs> For example, bone heaps can be sacrificed early but have util utility in late game. Well, how do you like that? They eventually had something to give you tips. Grimora wants to bring it all down, I swear. More is a mercy, I think. She's probably right. There's some pretty nasty data on this disc. Um. <clears throat> anyway, a deck focuses on magical cards. A deck focused on magical cards can be very powerful. Try picking two of your best gem colors instead of going for all three. Cards with activated abilities are some of the most powerful, balancing your resources accordingly. 
What you want to know about Magnificus? Mysterious guy. We all have our theories, of course. Some say he actually wants... Oh, well, it's too terrible to say. Interesting. Okay. I just saw you in a different... Oh, whatever. Answer this question and only this question. Um, is it in this building? Yes. Okay. Found by the pale. light colored which is why I thought like maybe that means it's out here because it's pale there <laughs> from the light outside I don't know and pale like pale and shovel is P-A-I-L so that's not what it is but I thought maybe it could be a play on words I don't know So then I was thinking, like, what symbol is next to the word pale? But it's literally just like a tent. <laughs> the middle sigil is found by the pale. The middle sigil is found by the pale. Well, I mean, this top clue is... The top sigil is found by the greedy, so you found it in a treasure chest, right? And it was a rabbit, so you put a rabbit head. And then this one is 
the bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing or by those who hear too easily which I assume is this because once you come in here the sound is muted right the middle sigil is found by the pale but no matter what symbol I put in here it's like unhappy with it what does pale mean pale means like um I think so I guess a way to say it is like lighter than usual like if someone um, is sick sometimes like the the color in their face has faded a bit you might say they look pale or um, if a color is kind of like washed out from light you might say it's pale let's look up what they actually say pale means <laughs> Yeah, light in color or shade, containing little color or pigment. Found by the pale. because you wish to challenge me to a card battle. In order to earn that privilege, you must first defeat my three graduate students. that it's nearly 1 a.m. Way past my bedtime.
No, sir. Dodger, how could you? How scummy of you. But I've tried everyone and it doesn't work, so there's something more to this. solve two-thirds and brute force on a couple of these but I but I've tried <laughs> I've tried to brute force this one and it's not working <coughs> yeah to be honest I don't really have any interest in watching critical role I know that sounds awful but I just if, if we're being honest <gasps> what Wait, so that means it's this. Wait, so then... I don't I still don't think I've seen or found whatever it is I need to find to do this. Okay, I think I need to go to bed. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to figure this out. I think I got to go to bed. Um, wait, what? Look. Look, I'll just come back to it. <laughs> I'll just come back to it. I'll figure it out another time. I'm normally asleep for a couple hours by now. <laughs> Um, okay. Uh, yeah, that was some more inscription. Um, <clears throat> let me read off the activity feed. Tomorrow, Clarky has a dentist appointment, um, like right around the time that we normally start. Uh, Sam and I have both now had 
um, doctor slash dentist visits where we were there on our own and it never goes well. So we decided that both of us are going to go with her to the dentist this time. Um, so I will be a little late to stream. I don't know how late, but I'll let you guys know. Um, we'll say tentatively like an hour late. And if it's going to be more than that, I'll tweet, I guess. Story Scarf, thank you for the 13 months. And Dead Brit for the five years. Happy anniversary. Thank you so much. Veiledverse, thank you for the 10. Kai Theron for the 32. Phantom 73 for the 30. Savaging Spillage for the 11. Pajama Mat for the 54. Tactful Valkyrie for the 15. Pop for the 2. Sevateel for the 43. Miss Big Hat for the 76. Missed SSB for the 51. John Pirate for the three years. Happy anniversary. B Apollo for the 20. Bowler for the 41. Dark Shadow for the five years as well. Happy anniversary. Thank you so much. Uh, Zick in it. Thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome to the cat gang. Bad Francis. Thank you for the 50 months. Keen Cat for the three years as well. Happy anniversary. Chrisic for the 39. Dr. She Devil for the nine. Happy Twitch Baby. Nicodemus for the 52. Silver at Heart for the 19. Cantrip Cat for the 13. Witch Tea for the 43. Nab That Cat and Run for the 38. And Rats Off to you for the 22. Um... Yeah, it was fun. I'm glad, dude. We like. I wish I had more energy because this the stuff that we found is fucking nuts. Um, let's see if Allie's still streaming. Yes. Okay. We're gonna go say hi to Ali Straza. Um, have fun, spread love, spread joy. I'll see you guys next time and take care of yourselves. Okay, bye-bye.